Hi everyone, Shauna here. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to go over some, I guess a baby haul. Some items that I've bought for the babies so far, that we've bought for the babies so far, and things that we've been given. So, <clears throat> first I want to go over some clothes that we have that we've gotten for the baby. Um, some of these I got at a consignment store, and then some of them we just bought. And I'll try to kind of tell you where, what things are what. First we have this little onesie, which I don't even know if he will ever fit in because it is a newborn size. Um, I got it before we found out how big he was going to be. He is going to, they're guessing he'll be between 8 to 9 pounds. And newborn sizes are only supposed to go up to 8 pounds, so he may not never fit in this, but it's just a cute little duck onesie. I bought this also before we found out he was a boy. I figured it would work for a boy or a girl. <clears throat> Next is another newborn outfit that I'm not sure if he will ever fit in, which it has, it's just a little onesie with some stars. It has yellow and silver stars on it, which I really like. I think it's really cute. Um, again, don't know if he'll ever fit in it though, because he's going to be big. <laughs> then next, this one is, it says zero to three months. So this should fit him, hopefully. It's just another sleeper with the little feet. It's just green stripes. Symbol, but cute. This was another one. So far, all of them that I've shown are ones I bought at a consignment store. I've already washed them all. Um, they all look in really good condition, no stains or anything. So I was very happy. They were all, I think, a dollar a piece. So pretty cheap. And then this is the last item that I got at a consignment store. This is also zero to three, just a little onesie. Um, I also bought this before I knew if he was a boy or a girl, so I just figured it would be a good unisex little onesie, zero to three months. So next I have, I bought a pack that came with five onesies from our just local drugstore. And we were out, we were actually grocery shopping one day, <laughs> and I decided to buy them. And so they're just five onesies. They are three to six months, so they're a little bit bigger. The first one is just, Silver stars. I really like stars. I actually have a tattoo of a star on my ankle, so I really like stars. <clears throat> and they're just silver stars. Um, the next one has little gray duckies. I look like they're in water. Cute. And then this one is blue with the little yellow ducks. And then just a gray and white striped one, and just a plain yellow one. I also bought all those before we found out he was a boy. I figured most of them would work whether he was a boy or a girl. Now these are two that were given to us from our family. Um, this one was given to us by our baby's aunt, my sister-in-law. Just says my aunt is the coolest. It's super soft material. It is three months, so we should be able to fit into that. And it's Carter's. Super cute. Really like that one. And then this one is my favorite. It's also three months. It's by the brand Jumping Beans. And this is so soft. The material of this one is amazing. I was really surprised by the quality and like the softness of the material. It just says worth the wait, which I love. Um, for those of you who don't know, my husband and I tried for almost two years um, before we got pregnant. I got pregnant back in March, and then we got we had a miscarriage in April. And so this is actually our second pregnancy this year. I got pregnant again in, I guess I got pregnant in June. We found out at the beginning of July that I was pregnant. I get it this time. So that one's really cute. Just worth the wait. And then next, um, I want to show, this is his first stuffed animal that he's been bought, I guess. He has other stuffed animals that are passed down for me and my husband that we had when we were kids. Um, but this is the first one that was bought. It's just a little tie-dye bear. Um, it's called Sparkle Bears Jewel. Our, my husband's grandmother bought this for us. So my son's great-grandmother. And it's just really cute. And then... <clears throat> just a couple decorative items. My mother-in-law loves Winnie the Pooh, and she got us the snow globe. And it says, together said Pooh is a very grand thing to be. It's just from Hallmark. It's just Pooh and Piglet in there. Really cute. Plays music. We really like that. She also got us this huge book, which is really nice. It's the Complete Tales of Winnie the Pooh. I didn't even know there were this many Winnie the Pooh stories, and I guess I should have, but I was not aware. But it has really nice pictures in it. Uh, it's a really large book. We're really excited to read that to him. And then 
she also got us this picture frame. It says a baby said Pooh is a very snuggly thing. And in it right now we have his 13 week ultrasound picture in there. Um, it was one where they actually showed like there's the head and his torso. And then his legs were over here off to the side. But you can see his arms and his little heart in there and his face. We really like that picture. And that picture frame is cute. These will not stay on this thing. We are planning on getting a large, like some wall shelves to go up top. And like breakable things like that will go up there. Um, real quick, I'm going to take you around the room real quick and just show you a few other larger things that I can't carry. Oh, I forgot. This is something I can carry. <laughs> a few other little things. <clears throat> so first is cloth wipe warmer that my mother-in-law gave us. We are planning on doing cloth diapering and cloth wipes. And so she got us this cloth wipe warmer. It came with a bunch of cloth wipes. And they are so soft. So nice. I can't wait to use that. It does plug in. I don't have the plug on it right now. But it does plug into the wall to keep it warm. Really cute. We do have some cloth diapers already. So this is the first one my mother-in-law got us. And it's super cute. It's just tie-dye. And it's a, this one's a Smart Bottoms. They're all in one. This is an all in one. Um, so it has the leaf there and then it also has a pocket where you can stuff extras. Really soft, really soft on the inside. My mother-in-law even commented on how soft it was. It is a newborn size. It's the only newborn one we have at the moment, but it does go up. I believe it said it goes up to 12 pounds. Maybe it was 16. I don't know. It's supposed to go pretty high, so I'm hoping, even though he's supposed to be a big baby, that the newborn, we're going to get a couple of newborns, and just um, just for like the very beginning. And then hopefully the one size ones will fit him after that. But that is the first newborn one, which is really cute. And then the others are just one size ones. These ones are from Charlie Banana. These I also got at a consignment store. Um, so they are, they are second hand, they're pocket diapers, um, but they all were in really good shape. They don't have any stains or anything on them. So the first one is just blue stars, stripes, I'm sorry, just blue stars. As I mentioned, these are Charlie Banana. They are pocket diapers and they came with microfiber inserts. Not a huge fan of the microfiber inserts. Um, I plan on getting bamboo or hemp. I think hemp is what I've read as the best. Um, but for now, they have the microfiber inserts in them, and they're just the pocket diapers. They seem pretty good. They're really large, though. I wish they had the snap-downs like the newborn has, like where you can snap it down to make it smaller. Um, I wish these ones had something like that so you can make them a little bit smaller because they just seem very, very large and very full. But hopefully they'll fit him when he gets a little bit bigger. And I think I bought, I think there was three, I got three of them for $8, which is super cheap for cloth diapers. So, we can't complain with that. The next one, it's the same style, so I'm not going to open it all up. But it's just white on the front, and then on the back, it just says cloth rocks. Again, it is the Charlie Banana, and this is the, they're the one size. So they're supposed to be one size fits all, and I think... I think they're, they start at 8 pounds and go up from there, so hopefully he'll be able to fit in these right away. If not, we'll have a few newborns to go with him for a while. Then the last one I got is just Blue Hearts. Um, again, it's Charlie Banana, one size, pocket diaper. They all came with the two microfiber inserts, so they all have those inside of them. And there's the other one. That's all the cloth diapers we have right now. We only have four. We plan, I have a lot on our registries, so hopefully we'll get more there. Um, and then we'll buy some more if we need to. So real quick now, I'm going to take you guys around the room and just show you the few little things we've bought so far in his nursery. So first is the changing table. As you can see, I already have the wipe warmer and the cloth diapers down there. And then we also have some water wipes that my mother-in-law gave us. Um, let me back up so you can see the whole thing. We are going to paint this. We are going to paint it white. That chair is from the dining room and won't normally be in there. But we are going to paint that chair, the changing table white. And I'm going to get new handles to put on them as well, I believe. So they all match. Because I did get this from an antique store. So it's a little beat up um, and the handles don't match. And then we have a changing pad up here. 
Um, I just got this, I believe at Target, it's just a normal changing pad with a changing pad cover. And then I got a few of these um, changing pad liners to go on it. Um, these are, I've heard are great because if they pee on this, you can just throw this, it's waterproof on the back. You can just throw this into the hamper, wash it, and then just put a new one on so you're not having to change the whole cover. So I really like that. <clears throat> we do have a swing that we got him, and that's actually one of my old stuffed animals that's in there right now. My husband put it in there. This my mother-in-law got us. It was from a garage sale, but I did take it all apart, wash everything, and put it back together. So really excited about that. It is just a Fisher-Price cradle swing, it says. And then this is currently filled with all of my husband and mine old stuffed animals, but it's just a travel bassinet. It's not going to stay in the room. It's going to go, probably, we'll probably keep it in our car. It folds up really tiny. And so we'll probably keep it in our car just so we have it to go like to grandma's houses and things like that. And then last, something we just bought today, I got this from Ikea, the shelf. We really like it. Um, we're going to use it for books on top there, like you see, and then we're also going to put little like, like cloth baskets to put in there so we can put toys and stuff in the bottom one so he'll be able to get to those. And then on top I have all the stuff I was showing you guys. <laughs> but that's everything we have so far. And then I, you guys saw all the books in the bookshelf. That's everything we have so far for him. We're really excited to meet him. We can't wait. We have painted the nursery. Hopefully here in the next week or two, we're gonna get the crib set up. We're gonna get white for that as well. We're gonna paint the changing table white. You saw the bookshelf is white. So we plan on all the furniture being white for the most part. Um, and then we're gonna do different color accents. Really excited though. I hope you guys enjoyed everything. I will try to link everything down below that I can find online. A lot of it, like I said, though, was from antique stores or consignment stores, so I won't be able to link it. But anything that I can find, I'll link down below. And I hope you guys join me for my next video. It will be coming up here in a few days. Make sure you subscribe and hit that like button. Thank you guys for joining me, and I will see you next time. Bye.